Did Autotune just drop the best new DSer in the game? Well, today, we're gonna find out. I'm Reed Stefan, Reels Puppet in the Game, and this is the new AI powered vocal DSer by Autotune. And I'm gonna be putting it to the ultimate test in a song that not only has a lot of sibilance, but has both singing and rapping vocals, so we can hear how this plugin performs in a variety of situations. So, as you can see, we've got a really simple user interface. Not a lot of controls, but what's going on under the hood is extremely powerful. Normally, a deesser is somewhat frequency based and it kind of works with filtering and dynamic EQ. Well, this is AI based. So, instead of listening to a frequency, it's actually listening to these letters and finding what to remove. And the best way to understand that is to just just listen to it with this headphone button on to solo what the plugin is processing. So let's go over here in the pre-chorus. <gasps> Gotta get away. I've been taking let's solo. Uh -huh. And those are the S's, the T's, and all the other things are untouched. So as you could hear, it's not looking for a specific frequency, it's looking for specific letters in the incoming audio signal. Really groundbreaking oh, stuff. That? So I'ma focus on anything but you. And not only that, but it does this all in real time. So if you were tracking through this plugin, you would have no issues with extra latency coming from the AI based DSer. But back to the actual mix, let's turn off our headphones. And we're still using the complete default preset on here. If you're not really sure about DSing, they have a really useful feature called Assist, which listens to the incoming signal for about five seconds and decides what it thinks are the best DSer settings. Let's give it a listen. So here's its recommendation. Let's apply it. If you didn't want it to be allowed to attenuate that hard, you could always reduce the attenuation amount here. Now, this is different from threshold. Threshold is how sensitive it is to reduce. And this is basically putting a limiter on how far you're going to let it reduce. Maybe you think it sounds natural up until about seven or eight dB. So we would put this at about here, set our threshold to adjust our sensitivity on the incoming signal. Let's bypass it. I'm a focus on anything but you. And with it. So you can hear just a little bit of harshness when you turn it off and that can come in any microphone recording and usually the more budget friendly your microphone is the more prone to harshness it's going to be. I have this plugin going at the very end of my vocal chain but you could really put it anywhere along the way. Down here, I have lots of doubles and stacks and things that emphasize the important words. And I've also applied a multi mono version of the vocal deesser to all these stacks. And we could push these even harder than we did the leads. So I'm always thinking, how sensitive do I want it? And how much attenuation do I want to allow to take place? Let's go over to the verse where we have some rap vocals and see how the autotune vocal de performs. Focus on anything but you. I ain't with a chick trying to mess up my cool. Let's pull it down a little bit more. Pretty hella icy cause I'm covered in jewels. On the everyday vacation, that's my occupation. Turn the reduction up. Man, why? I could see your aggravation cause I got paper from all the- I just wanted to dial in some really extreme media. settings just and to push it and see what we get. If they keep trying, uh, I ain't replying. I just put my phone on silent because I like my peace and quiet. It's actually quite forgiving until you get all the way up to the top of the settings. But again, it's really just sniping these consonants. Let's hear it in Delta mode. Everything is just getting nailed. And it's not just one little band of the frequency. It's the whole consonant is getting pushed down. And I love that. And there's nothing you could do about it. They keep trying. Uh, I ain't replying. I just put my phone on silent because I like my peace and quiet. And now let's bypass all four instances of the vocal de in this session and hear it again. And vocal 
the answer. So there you have a first look at Autotune's new AI-powered vocal de -esser. This really does take all the challenging guesswork out of de and just help you dial in the perfect settings instantly without worrying about frequencies, let it interpret the content of my vocal and adjust it accordingly. If you want to learn more about the new vocal de by Autotune, I'll include links in the description below and catch you guys next time in another video.